you want to work digitally for this project, what we're first going to do is we're going to find our reference image and then we're going to put that in um, our app called Adobe Fresco. <clears throat> if you haven't downloaded this app yet, make sure you do that. I'm going to go online and I'm going to search for my um, image that I would like to recreate in uh, Adobe Fresco and I chose this um, octopus. I'm going to click on that and then add it to my photo album. Once I have it in my photo album, I can import it into Fresco. So I'm going to start a new document in Fresco. I'm going to think of how my photo was. Was it more landscape or was it more portrait style? So I'm going to hit print and mine was longer width than height. So I'm going to make sure that it's on portrait, uh, landscape, not portrait. Ready is, so I'm going to click on that. And now I can import my photo. So I'm going to go to my photo album, find this image and make it nice and large and place it in this document. Now I can always resize this, um, but the larger it is right now, it will be easy to recreate. When I'm done, I'm gonna hit done. And now um, I'm gonna create a new layer on top of it and I'm going to draw on top of it. I recommend using your vector brush, okay? Um, there are different um, uh, styles that you can use. I recommend using basic taper. That is gonna have a little bit more dynamic line because it goes from thin to thick in areas. Now, um, it might be a little bit hard to draw on top and like see where you're drawing. So I'm going to click on my photo image go to these three dots right here up at the top and I'm gonna drop the opacity a little bit. So it's just a little bit easier. I would keep around 60, don't go too far, too low. Um, then you won't be able to see your photo. I'm gonna close that, go back to my drawing layer and I'm gonna zoom in and I'm gonna carefully draw. Oh, and that looks like a little too thick of a brush Maybe drop it to about three and I'm going to carefully draw the detail, the outline of my image. Go ahead and finish that up and then I'll show you the next step.